So basically, we run away. Basically, now we want to go um, where the passwords. Oh, yeah, the monsters get changed up. So, talk this. This is for the best ending, viewer. This is why we're doing this. And we just found Chris. All right, Chris, let's get out of here. Oops. Sorry about fast forwarding. <laughs> oh. God damn it. Yes. Yes. Ah. That's good. Let's go. Now before doing anything else, let's take the rest of our magnum rounds. Uh Take the acid rounds. As you climb it, I'm gonna first of all save state. Hurry! Brad is there. So Brad is still around. Ah, oh, shit. Um, I forgot that I, I needed this. Oh, well, at least I'm fully healed, which is good. Battery is pulled out. No shit, it's right here in my inventory. Ah, oh, fucking hell. Three minutes. Oh no, you must be kidding. After you've come all the way here. Ladies first. Go first, Jill. But Chris... Uh. Give me a chance to play nice guy. Okay, I leave it up to you. See you again at the heliport. Yeah. Well, of course he needs the, uh... He's been stuck in a jail cell all this time. Alright, so I wanna quickly take this, take the flare, yes. And I wanna use the flare. 
over here. That's going to call the helicopter. And I got two minutes left to beat the game. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit. The tyrant is back. Uh. Run away from the tyrant. E. Basically, you want to run away from him. It's coming! Jill! Kill that monster! You're our Amazon, Jill! <laughs> Yeesh. Come on, Jill. There we go. We take the rocket launcher? Yes. There we go. Brutal death for it, the tyrant. <clears throat> and here's the ending. live action scene and Joe was so tired that she was sleeping on Chris how cute So that was uh, Resident Evil, um, and yes, they just go by first name for the uh, voice actors. So basically, I hope you enjoyed this uh, LP. <laughs> um, I'm probably gonna do Chris's side of the story. If you want me to, please comment, uh, saying yes, I want to see Chris's side of the story. Man, these cutscenes are cool. <laughs> yeah, basically, that's something we could have seen if I didn't use the uh, plant killing thingy. Overall, it's a good game. Uh, voice acting, it that really needed something better than just what they had. I think. They just took some random English speaking people and made them voice act the game. And they had no clue what the hell they were saying. That's how I feel about the voice acting. And the graphics are pretty cool. I mean, all of the uh, backgrounds are uh, pre rendered. So that was. And for its time, it's a pretty good game. It's pretty good graphics for its time. Um, I suggest you guys play this. It's out on the Nintendo DS if you can't find the uh, original version. Uh, this is the uh, director's cut uh, for uh, PlayStation. But yeah, there's the uh, Nintendo DS version. Total time. 
Hmm, not bad. Three hours and a half with four saves. With a nice picture of Jill there. And we've got the special key for the closet, which changes our costumes. So yeah, that's about it. So overall, this game is a pretty good game. The story is pretty good, and all that, so... So yeah, that was a that was Resident Evil, and uh, I will see you next time. This has been Life of Honor, and let's play Resident Evil.